The following message is transmitted at the request of the United States Geological Survey. At 1.46 a.m. Mountain Daylight Time, an earthquake with a magnitude of 7.6 on the Richter scale has occurred at Yellowstone National Park in Wyoming. This quake has been centered along the mouth of the Yellowstone River. This earthquake has caused serious damage to the Yellowstone condos and suites in the Vacation Rentals Center. This quake has possibly triggered the Yellowstone supervolcano to erupt, but an eruption cannot be confirmed at this time. All residents within a 50-mile radius of Yellowstone National Park are advised to seek shelter immediately. Close and lock all windows and doors. Turn off all heating and air conditioning systems. Close all fireplaces. Seal all cracks on doors and windows with tape or damp towels. Prepare to evacuate if an eruption is imminent. Stay away from this area. The following message is transmitted at the request of the Federal Emergency Management Agency. A volcano watch has been issued for the entire Pacific and Mountain Time Zones of the United States due to the potential of the Yellowstone Supervolcano at Yellowstone National Park in Wyoming erupting within the next few days. This is a result of a large 7.6 magnitude earthquake that struck the mouth of the Yellowstone River earlier. A volcano watch means that a volcano eruption is not necessarily likely, but cannot be ruled out within the next few days. All residents receiving this broadcast are advised to prepare to evacuate when an eruption is imminent. Prepare supplies such as food, water, medical supplies, and a battery-powered radio. Remain vigilant at this time. Tune into local media outlets for further information on this developing situation. The following message is transmitted at the request of the Federal Emergency Management Agency. A volcano warning has been issued for areas within a 500-mile radius of Yellowstone National Park due to a catastrophic eruption of the Yellowstone supervolcano being likely in the next 24 hours. A large ash cloud will spread hundreds of miles from the eruption, destroying the area and will be covered in ash. A volcano warning means that a volcano eruption is imminent. All residents receiving this broadcast are strongly advised to evacuate immediately. Grab all of the people in your home. Grab food, water, medical supplies, and a battery-powered radio for your journey. Do not pick up any relatives from schools, hospitals, or nursing homes. These facilities have their own evacuation procedures, and will be safe. Tune into local media outlets for further information on this dangerous situation. regular programming. This is a national emergency. Important details will follow. The following message is transmitted at the request of the United States government. This is not a test. I repeat, this is not a test. At 3.38 a.m. Mountain Daylight Time, the Yellowstone supervolcano has erupted, sending an ash cloud more than 10 kilometers in the atmosphere. This ash cloud has destroyed everything within a 1,000-mile radius. More than 30 inches of ash has been reported in areas within a 100-mile radius, and other areas have received between 5 and 10 inches of ash. All residents of the United States should seek shelter immediately. 
If you reside in the Pacific or Mountain time zones, evacuate to the eastern United States immediately. Lock all windows and doors, turn off all heating and air conditioning systems, close all fireplaces, and cover cracks and doors and windows with tape or damp towels. The President will speak on our news station shortly. Stand by. This is an emergency action notification. All broadcast and cable systems will transmit this emergency action notification message. This station has interrupted its regular programming at the request of the White House to participate in the emergency alert system. During this emergency, most stations will remain on the air, providing news and information to the public in assigned areas. This is KMBC. We will continue to serve the Kansas City area. If you are not in this local area, tune now to a station providing news and information for your area. You are listening to the emergency alert system serving the Kansas City area. Do not use your telephone. The telephone line should be kept open for emergency use only. The emergency alert system has been activated to keep you informed. This is a volcano warning for the following states, Baja California, Baja California Sur, Chihuahua, Sonora, Northwestern Durango, Eastern Sinaloa, Western Nuevo Leon, Western Zacatecas, and near it due to a possible eruption of the Yellowstone Supervolcano. Evacuate the states of Baja California, Baja California Sur, Chihuahua, Sonora, Northwestern Durango, Eastern Sinaloa, Western Nuevo Leon, Western Zacatecas, and near it. Because these states will get the most ash. All citizens in these states should seek shelter or evacuate. Now, stand by for the President of Mexico. Please stand by for a representative of the President. Fellow Mexicans and the Eplis of the Nedas you are as an Aison attacked the United Mexican States with nuclear weapons me and the rest of the government are aiding out waiting for the wars of the past and the urge of every citizen to do the same if you haven't already done no please take a fallout shelter we pray for every one of our citizens live or no to we want you to stay to net to media outlets for further information and you need venture outside into his declarations of todos so please get a supply of food and water at least up to 14 days for your stay in the shelter in sorry but for no we have to go for we pray for you and we pray for all the life of Mexico. Please stand by. Please stand by. Our national anthem. Civil danger for the United States. The following message is transmitted at the request of the National Weather Service. Due to the eruption of the Yellowstone supervolcano three days ago, multiple strange weather disturbances have been reported across the United States. These disturbances include tornadoes with 375 mile per hour plus winds in the plains, below freezing temperatures in the south, and 110 degree plus temperatures in the north. It is expected that the United States will experience an extremely hot winter and a very cold summer. Residents in the north should keep cool and turn up the air conditioning if volcanic ash isn't present. Residents in the south should keep warm and cover yourself with multiple layers of clothing. Residents in the plains should cover your head with your hands with blankets and pillows, and should stay away from any flying debris. An administrative message from the United States government, along with the National Weather Service. 
The volcanic ash from the Yellowstone supervolcano eruption one year ago has cleared out of the United States. As a result, the climate of the U.S. has changed back to normal. The strange weather disturbances that have been happening for the past year have stopped. All residents may exit their shelters at this time. But, if you live within a 100-mile radius of Yellowstone National Park, please remain in your shelters as very slight amounts of volcanic ash are still on the ground in your area. This ash will be cleared in the next month. This is an administrative message at the request of the United States government, along with the National Weather Service.